Hey everybody, thanks for sticking around. We're gonna work on two different vowels today. They're very similar, but we've gotta make sure we differentiate them really well. The first one is aw, like wall. Now the lips are slightly rounded, but only slightly. The jaw has to drop in order to do this sound. Um, you're gonna notice that the sound might be slightly on the British side, but there's a reason for this. Let's get into it. Aw, wall. Warm, all, cause, law, daughter, one, call, because, all, taught, Walk, small, pause, awful, caught, storm, also, applaud, jaw, brought, Lord, always taunt, saw, bought. Now, if you're having trouble with this, you might want to think about making space in your back teeth. Like if you're going to bite into a big hamburger, aw, aw. Otherwise, if you just open the front, aw, aw, you're not going to get the right sound and it's probably going to wind up in your nose. So that's all, and the symbol for that, the IPA symbol, is the backwards looking C. Kind of looks like that. Let's move on to the next one. This next vowel is a little bit peculiar because it's always followed by an R. Now I did say in an earlier video that there's a special rule that goes with the R. We're not going to talk about that yet, but just know today that when there's an R, you're not going to pronounce it. So the word we're going to look at first is learn. So the sound is uh. Now the R, if we pronounce it, it's gonna sound very much country. Learn, learn. And what you'll notice is it also constricts your vocal tract. So in this case, we're going to lean more towards a British pronunciation. Here we go. Learn her bird word bird. Yearn, sermon, girl, world, burden, search, serve, whirl, worm, turn, earth, Person, twirl, worth, return, heard, mercy, birth, fur, stir. So by the way, that IPA symbol for that last vowel that we did, uh, is it kind of looks like a three or a backwards E or a sideways M, kind of like the McDonald's. Can I say McDonald's? The McDonald's arches, but turn on the side. So these sounds are very similar. We're gonna start with the uh as in learn and then go to all as in all. Let's just go back and forth between both vowels. Uh, again. So you can see the uh is a little bit more closed than the aw, uh, which is more open. And that opening comes from the jaw. Now let's compare the two. Learn, lawn, worship, worship, Yearn, yawn, word, ward, bird, board, er, ah, 
firm form burn born stir store turn torn so all our rules that we have concerning singing and pronunciation they're really made to make our singing legato as smooth as possible you know, th there are constrictions in the vocal track to make the different sounds, but we've got to make them as minimal as possible. So if you're trying to get that country sound, you know what to do. If you want to sing, I was born by the river in a little tent. Well, we've got that little bit of the twang and we've got a little bit of that funky R that we took out. I was born by the river. There you go. So if you want to sound country, now you know what to do.